What is up guys and welcome to another Red Dead Online video. Today I will be going through the highest stamina and the highest health horse within the game. This is the only horse within Red Dead Online that does have max stamina and max health. There are other horses now because of the Frontier Pursuits update which do have max other stats and eventually we will go and get videos out on them. But today we are focusing on the Clad Ruber. To get the Clad Ruber or the one that will have max stamina and max health you need to go and max out your trade trader at rank 20 you then need to go and use free unlock tokens to go and unlock it and then on top of all of that if that wasn't enough you then need to go and spend 950 dollars to then go and get it within your stable at that point you then need to go and buy a saddle for it and that will then increase other stats as well this horse can be found under multi but by looking at their stats they are a work slash war horse and you can unlock other versions of it by progressing through the trader at rank one trader you can go and unlock the black and white clad ruber at rank 10 you can then go and unlock another version which will be in cremello and gray but the one that you really want the one that has the max stamina and the max health is at rank 20 and that will give you a silver and dapple rose gray color for the clad ruber if you get a rank 20 horse which is what i do recommend it is pointless getting the rank 10 or the rank 1 horses the rank 20 horse will start with 7 health and stamina but once you get to level 4 bonding that is when you'll be able to go get 10 health and 10 stamina the speed and acceleration is not best with this horse it is default at four with speed but that could be maxed out at seven and default for five acceleration but that could be maxed out at eight it goes without saying that you can still go and use this horse for racing but it's not the best at speed acceleration or even handling you are better off using other types of horses but what this horse is good for is being a trader or a bounty hunter with this horse's high health it goes without saying that it can take a lot of bullets the horse's bravery is also at a high which only gets better as you are increasing it with bonding which means that you will not be thrown off the back of your horse the second a predator is nearby if you do stay too close to a predator for long yes you will be thrown off the back of the clad ruber but the clad ruber gives you more than enough time to pull out your bolt action rifle to get that perfect kill before the horse even thinks about throwing you off the back the clad ruber is only available by progressing through the trader role and requires you to get to rank 20 use free unlock tokens and also spend 950 dollars or 38 gold bars and this horse only gets max stamina and max health once you go and get this horse to level 4 bonding a way that you can go and do this there is no really really quick way which can be done within a matter of minutes you do need to go and put some time into it obviously if you're going to be using this horse to go and do trades to go and do bounty hunting its bonding level will naturally increase it increases every time you go and ride a horse but what you can do is just go and stand by its side hold the left trigger and go through all the different options which is brush in, feeding, leading and also patting. If you go and do these within that order as soon as you go through brushing, feeding, leading and patting you then go back through brushing again and go through it continuously. What will happen is you will get a bunch of different XP for your horse. You'll see it pop up on the right side of your screen and it does not take too long to go and do. The longest one is leading. You do need to walk with it for about maybe five maybe even ten seconds and then you'll see it pop up on your screen. As soon as you go and see that XP that horse bonding symbol pop up on your screen that is when you go on to the next one it's very tedious work for you to go and do this you'll get round about 5 xp for just doing one of those things so every time you go through this you'll be getting 20 xp and it doesn't take too long for you to go and do that but it does still take some time for you to go and get this to level 4 bonding you can go and do this which is a much quicker way of doing it or you could just ride your horse go and do different stuff with your horse and then eventually it will get to level 4 bonding it does take a bit longer to go and do but you're not worrying about it and it's not a constant grind just to go and get this to level four but anyway guys this is the clad ruber horse the only horse within the game that has max stamina and also max health and it can only be done within red dead online unfortunately this is not part of the story mode but anyway guys i hope you guys did enjoy if you did enjoy don't forget to leave a like and subscribe but for now i'm going so see ya